In today's Come Pack With Me video, I'm going to share my main luggage, carry-on, travel essentials, what I'm going to pack for my trip, and organizing and packing tips. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, welcome. My name is Priya. I share about all things fashion, maximizing your wardrobe and tons of outfits inspirations over here. So please consider subscribing to my channel. Part of today's video is sponsored by Teddy Blade. I will talk about them little later in this video and I will also share a unique code and discount available on their site. So stay tuned for that. So we are going to London next week. We are visiting my sister and her husband there. And also my parents are joining us in London. So it will be a fun family trip. Also, we are planning to visit Paris and Switzerland while we are there. So I need to pack for all those trips as well. And stay tuned for luxury shopping vlogs, what I wore and winter outfit inspirations. So don't forget to hit that bell icon so that you won't miss any updates from my channel. We are going for a month, but we are only allowed one main luggage and one carry-on. So it's quite a challenge for me to pack everything I need in these two. In this video, I will give you some tips on how to pack for your trip. So without any further ado, let's start packing. First comes main luggage. While choosing your main luggage, here's what you need to consider. Size, color, and style that works for you. Durability is important because a good suitcase will last you years to come and also be able to last through some tough travel conditions. Another factor to consider is if it's lightweight or heavy and how much weight it can hold. Also think about price when purchasing a suitcase as well as the security features like locking zippers. I have this a hard case piece that comes in at just over $100 and is available at Walmart with great reviews. I love how stylish this looks and also it expands up to 2 inches. It rolls with ease and provides different interior packaging compartments like removable laundry bag, shoe pockets, wet pack pocket and elastic cross straps. This luggage also has a push button locking handle and weighs up to 10.4 pounds. I will link this luggage in the description box below along with the dimensions. Next is your carry-on. When choosing your carry-on, again, check the size of it. Usually, it should be around 19 inches. And I have this Delcy Paris expandable luggage. It comes in 10 colors, but I love this silver with black accents. It also has a 10-year limited warranty. It comes with four spinner wheels, which makes it easy for your travel and lugging it around the airport. This also expands up to 2 inches for additional packing space, which is always great. This 19-inch carry-on size is perfect for weekend getaways and short business trips as well. It has an integrated parrot sleeve in the front to fit up to your 15.6 inch laptop or for your travel documents. It comes with fully lined interior, offers two packing compartments with tie down straps on one side and a zipper divider on the other side to minimize shifting of contents. This zippered pocket holds delicate items and accessories. I absolutely love this carry on and it's very steady. Coming to the travel bag, consider a tote that fits everything you need during your travel. From holding your passports to carrying all of your essentials, it should fit everything nicely. For this trip, I opted for a travel handbag that combines the best feature of these two styles. Crossbody bag that allows me to keep my hands free while traveling through busy terminals while still having easy access to my essentials, travel documents, passport, phone, charger, etc. I personally love this tote from Givenchy. This is the perfect size tote that looks good on my fit body. I have filmed my honest review and tons of outfit inspiration about this G tote. I will link it here if you are interested. If you are planning a trip to London or anywhere this winter, here are my top picks for what to pack and how to pack them. This is the type of stuff always makes me feel stylish and also comfortable. First, I'll make a list on what to take on my trip, like number of sweaters, denim, skirts, coats, handbags and other essentials. I'm planning on taking my mini Gucci Diana bag with me on this trip. This is very versatile and can be worn crossbody as a shoulder bag or as a top handle. I know it comes with a hefty price tag, but I have an affordable option for you. Here comes my Teddy Blake Kim bag. This part of the video is sponsored by Teddy Blake. I love this brand. They make luxury handbags with no luxury price tag. All the materials they use are high quality and their leather is just very luxurious. These bags are made in Italy with premium Italian leather with different finishes like pebbled, smooth, textured while being so durable. Their designs are also very luxury inspired and works well with so many outfits particularly love this design and the details also i love the interior as well it comes with a crossbody strap 
this bag is very practical i can wear it cross body on my shoulder or as a top handle i paired this bag with formal outfits casual or even dressy outfits it goes well with almost any style of outfit these bags are great for christmas gifts for the special women in your life or even for treating yourself i love their packaging their great quality leather luxurious designs and low prices there are so many upcoming offers and deals for this holiday season so this would be the best time to shop your favorite bag from teddy blake I will link my discount code and to my favorite bags below so be sure to check them out and feel free to comment below if you have any questions. I'm going to take eight sweaters with me on this trip. First one is this striped sweater from H&M. It has this loose fitted sleeves. I love this sweater a lot. And next one is this black sweater from Zara like 2 years ago. I love this white piping detail. Next one is this basic turtleneck from Express. This can be a great base layer piece. Next one is this gray sweater from Madewell. I got this at Nordstrom anniversary sale. I love this rib detail. This sweater is from Banana Republic. I love how thick this feels. And also you can never go wrong with this tan color. Next one is this cutout knitwear from Nordstrom. I love this color. It comes in green, black, so many great colors. I love this bright blue in this. Okay, this one is one of my favorite sweaters from my entire trip. This sweater is from Express. I love this collar detail and I can't wait to style this. And last one is this green sweater from Nordstrom as well. I love this balloon sleep detail and this comes in so many colors as well. Let's go to denims and pants now. First one is this Levi wedgie icon fit. I love this denim. It goes well with any top or sweater. These are modern skinny fits so it doesn't look so bulky on you and these fit true to size. Next one are this basic black denim from Express. These are skinny jeans. I love wearing skinny jeans with boots. So this is a must have for me on this trip. Next one is this wide leg pant from Zara. I love this unfinished hem detail. These fit perfectly for me. These faux leather pants are must have to create any holiday look. These are very comfortable and fits true to size. Next one are these pants faux leather leggings which is a staple in my closet especially in fall and winter I love pairing them with my sweaters and tops and this is a staple for this trip as well I'm taking these two skirts with me on this trip first one is this beautiful copper bronze satin skirt from Amazon this is very inexpensive I think it is under $30 and it comes in so many colors next one is this asymmetrical midi skirt from Halogen I have this skirt for three years now it pairs well with tops blouses sweaters and under a coat as well and it fits true to size and I'm taking five dresses on this trip. First one is this beautiful chocolate brown maxi dress. I love this rib detail and it's very stretchy. And also it has this padded shoulders as well. So it gives hourglass shape to the body. And next one is this trending hot pink midi dress. It has this frayed detail and it feels very cozy. This is from Nordstrom as well. Next one is this cowl neck slip satin dress. This green is perfect for holidays. I love pairing this under a sweater or a coat. Slip satin dresses are must have in every woman's wardrobe. And this one is from Express and it fits true to size. Also, it comes in so many colors like black, beige, all the neutrals and also these bright colors as well. Next one is this gray midi dress from Express. I love these balloon sleeves and a rip neck detail. I love this gray. It goes well with all the winter outfits. And the last one is this beautiful cobalt blue rib maxi dress. This is also from Nordstrom and I love this keyhole back. I'm so excited to style this this winter. And I'm taking three coats with me on this trip. First one is this pink long coat. This one is from Banana Republic. This is very structured and pairs well with all the basics. I love this gray collar detail here. I got this two years ago. So I'll find similar coats and link them in the description box below. So be sure to check it out. Next one is my recent gifted coat from Zulili. And this one is by Colhan. I absolutely love this coat. I love the shade of green and these relaxed label collars. And it comes with a belt. So it gives shape to your outfit. Fit. It comes for under $100 which is on sale right now on Zulili. I absolutely love this coat. And the last one is my most favorite coat from Sam Edelman. This one has a mixed materials. This is made with suede material and sleeves, collar and other details have leather which is a great combination to look chic and edgy as well. I love all the details around this coat. Even with the belt, one side it has a suede material and the other side it has a leather material. I'm so excited to style this coat this winter season. And I'm taking three jackets with me on this trip. First one is this puffer jacket from Zara. It has that oversized look and it feels very warm. Next one is this faux fur jacket from Abercrombie & Fitch. I absolutely love this color and it feels very warm and cozy. And the last one is my new Chanel inspired crop jacket from Urban Revival. 
I love these sleeves and this is very affordable. This is under $120. I will link this jacket in the description box below if you are interested. And also I'm taking this sequin blazer which is perfect for this holiday season. This blazer is from Kupchi. It is a beachwear and tropical inspired brand created for the most vibrant, fun and fearless women. Now they have expanded it to a complete clothing store. Their pieces are best in quality, look stylish and very affordable. I received this blazer yesterday and immediately thought of packing this since it would be a great holiday addition to any outfit. I will link this blazer in the description box below. They have so many great holiday deals going on so be sure to check it out. And I'm bringing two belts with me. One is this Gucci Mormont belt and next one is this Louis Vuitton reversible belt. Moving over to the shoes, I'm bringing two boots, one loafers and two dressy heels. These chunky loafers are from H&M. These are very sturdy and very thick. These are perfect for those rainy days in London. Next one are these Mark Fisher black boots. These have very low heel which is great for me to walk all day long. And the last one are these over the knee boots by Steve Madden. These go well with almost every outfit for me. These are very comfortable to walk all day long as well. And coming to my dressy heels, my first pair are these rhinestone embellished Zara heels. These go well with almost any outfit for me. And next one are these bold red heels. These are by Mark Fisher and these are just stunning and takes any holiday outfit to the next level. And my winter essentials like hats, gloves, hand warmers scarves, tights, thermals from Costco and ear warmers. I will upload how I'm going to style all these and my new purchases from London. So don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit that bell icon so you won't miss any updates from my channel. Now that you know what to pack, it's time for travel essentials. Here's a list of everything I bring on my trips. I'm going to be living out of my suitcase for the next few weeks. So I have to make sure I have all my essentials. Here are my travel essentials and organizers I take on every trip. Those help me look put together and keeps me organized throughout the trip. First one is a lint roller. It is a must have for any trip because you don't want to look with lint on your clothes. I have this portable lint roller by Flint from Amazon. I love the look of it too. I can easily carry it on my handbag as well. Wrinkle releaser is also a great essential to take on a trip. This helps quickly remove all the wrinkles on your clothes. I use this travel size wrinkle releaser by Downey from Amazon. Fashion tape can be used in a place of safety pins and will give you an extra level of confidence while wearing important pieces like blazers, coats or blouses. I have uploaded a video about 10 tools every woman needs in their closet. Don't forget to check it out after this video. So for shoes, insoles allow us to walk long distance without pain or blisters so that we can look stylish and be comfortable while traveling. And the last one is this instant strain remover. You need this definitely if you are traveling with kids. These come very handy and quickly removes the stains. It's very convenient to carry it on your travel bag. This comes in separately packaged pouches. I place a couple of these in my travel bag and remaining in my main luggage. Now coming to the organizers, jewelry organizers are perfect for keeping your rings and necklaces organized so they don't get tangled in your bag. The jewelry organizer will help you keep all of your jewelry neat, organized and safe while you're on the go. I use these three organizers. One is the smaller one if you're going away for, for a weekend and this medium one if you're going away for a week and this large one if you're going away for all month. I'm taking these two because as, as I told you guys earlier, we are going to Paris and Swiss trip for a week. So this medium organizer would be perfect for that. Toiletry organizers are also very important and highly recommended. This one is the best travel organizer with different compartments and a hanging hook, which makes it easy to hang it over a hanging rod. It is also a water resistant makeup bag and it fits full size toiletries. It comes with two way zipper closure for quick access and has four separate compartments with zip and back open pocket, a great organization. Also, it has inner main pockets with elastic straps, which holds bottles upright. And these transparent sides provide clear overview of contents. You can pack skincare in one compartment and makeup products in other so that you can have everything together in one bag and it keeps all of your beauty essentials well organized. This is under $30 and it comes in 10 different colors or prints and has thousands of five star reviews on Amazon. Now the packing cubes. These are great for keeping everything organized inside your bag so you don't have to spend so much time finding your favorite sweater. 
You can use them for anything from socks, pants, shirts, even your shoes. They come in different sizes depending on the size of your bag, but they are all lightweight which makes packing easier since they take up less space inside each compartment inside your luggage while still keeping things separated nicely. I personally love this set from Amazon. This is a six piece set with four different sizes like extra large, large, medium and small. It also comes with one laundry bag and a shoe bag. These feels very thicker and these are waterproof. These travel essentials packing cubes can help to reduce clothing wrinkles by preventing movement inside the luggage. You can use one packing cube per group or you can pack by outfit either way everything will stay organized throughout your trip. And lastly these travel shoe bags. This helps protect your shoes against scuffs and scrapes when storing in suitcase. These keeps your shoes well organized and dust free while traveling. These travel shoe bags are foldable, lightweight, portable and very convenient to use. These can be used not just as a shoe bags, also can be used as a travel bags, toiletry bags, packing bags, gym bags, laundry bags, dust bag and for other uses as well. It comes with a set of 12 or under $15 from Amazon. Now coming to the packing tips. Keeping your belongings organized will help you feel less haired and stressed out. So it's important to have a system that makes sense for you. For example, I like to pack my toiletries in the main compartment of my suitcase since I can access them easily without unpacking everything else. Your makeup products might be better suited for packing in your carry-on or cosmetic case, which means that you don't have to open up your entire suitcase every time you need some foundation or a mascara. If you are bringing luxury handbags, belts and other accessories with you on vacation, consider packing them in your carry-on in their own dust bag so they don't get crushed by the heavier items or in a transit. Packing light is the best way to ensure you don't overpack and you'll have more room in your suitcase for souvenirs or additional shopping at your destination. Plus, it's much easier to carry around just a few than an entire suitcase full of heavy items. I recommend packing outfits that mix and match so you can wear the same shirt with different bottoms like jeans or skirts and accessories like scarves and hats. This will save so much space in your luggage. It is also important to pack shoes that are comfortable for walking long distances without breaking down your feet. I suggest bringing at least one pair of low heel boots in winter for daytime activities like sightseeing or museum visits, another pair of shoes for evening out and make sure these are waterproof because we don't know when it's going to rain in London. You are going to want to keep all of the items that you need during the flight in your travel bag and other must have things should be placed in your carry-on like luxury handbag and belts, laptop or other valuables. Pack your toiletries in a small pouch in your travel bag so that you can find them easily. Pack a travel document holder with your passport and other travel documents. I use this Kiragami medium pusher to hold all of our passports. I think it can easily hold up to four passports. That's it you guys, that's all I need in London and I hope you find all of my packing tips and travel essentials helpful. If you have any question, leave them in the comment section below and stay tuned for shopping vlogs and tons of outfit inspirations this winter. As always, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon in my next video. Bye!